decision. So, we are about to begin. Match starting in 3, 2, 1. We get teleported to the Nexus and Dragonshire. Seriously, I get Dragonshire so often. Gonna be playing as Abatha for anyone just tuning in now. This is my first actual game with Abatha, so I have no idea at all how it's gonna go. And that could be pretty tough. Yellow Leo, uh, currently there aren't any other skins for Abatha. Uh, quite a few champions only have the one skin for the moment, but there's different colouring taints, so you can change the colour of him when you unlock quests and stuff. Every skin has currently three different colour taints, so that's pretty cool. If you want to see what they all look like, I've got on my YouTube video a whole ton of hero highlights, one for every hero currently in the game where I look at skins and colour variations and things. So just go check that out. Dragonshire, of course, is the map I've played the most on. And it looks like I am going to be getting those unhappy Choose connection a issues. Talent. Acceptable. Okay, hopefully this isn't going to be too bad. Of course, Abatha in lane is just like the worst thing ever. You want to stay out of lane. Uh, so what do I have? I have combat adaptations, empowers your locusts, or locusts gain health. I'm going to go for the top one. My abilities, I can deep tunnel to anywhere on the map, seconds. which is pretty cool. Um, I don't know if I can actually tunnel there now. If I can, that'd be hilarious. Looks like, yeah, I can. Okay, no, it does take me back. I was going to say, if I could deep tunnel out, that'd be insane. Um, okay, anyway. Symbiote. Battle commencing basically. Ten seconds. Buffs the target. Um, so I stay out of combat, but I can buff a target in a pretty large Five, radius, as you can see on the mini map four, there. Three, uh, toxic two, next means one. that I start getting some nice damage down. Let the battle begin. Basically, it means that I can burst anything that comes into it. And I also automatically spawn locusts every few seconds. So, I just want to come and tunnel down, uh, probably round to... Why is it not letting me deep tunnel? This is a bit strange. I don't know what's going on here. Oh, it has to be somewhere I can see. So, of course, we can see Diablo taking some damage there. So, I'm going to cast my symbiote on him. I can stab, shoot a spike towards an enemy. I can also spike burst, deals 40 damage to enemies near the ally that Abathur is assisting. Alternatively... Uh, it's done its weird thing. Sometimes it does that, where the camera gets locked, and that's really annoying. But still, uh, come back on Abathur, as on Diablo, with my symbiote. I've also got Carapace, which means I take bonus da I can reduce the damage taken by Diablo. You can get some more damage down. Of course, just chipping it out, helping Diablo, keeping him nice and happy. Give him a shield quickly. Of course I can spam these abilities, they don't actually cost me any mana or anything like that, which is really important. My locust should still keep spawning out as well. And for the moment I'm completely safe, but it looks like we're not going to get much more move out from Diablo at the moment. Need to just drop down some more toxic nests, and only put three at a time unfortunately. Stitches went for the hook there, I'm going to go for another symbiote. Still waiting for a bit of a move forward. Diablo just needs to play a bit more carefully. As long as he's staying in EXP range, it's great. The downside to Abatha is that it is 1.5 in lane. Really until he levels up. Once he hits level 6, he can take a copy of any hero in the game. Which is huge. It makes him really strong. So a Stitches hook come through there. He backs away too soon. He needs to be more... Confident with this play. Might go and help one of the other lanes soon. They are actually holding both towers at the moment. Uh, so we need to be a bit careful of that. They're going to get the Dragon Knight, so going to tunnel up here quickly. I wasn't paying enough on that. Drop some of those down quickly. Slowly try and work it through. Hopefully someone will come and help down here, otherwise we will run into problems very quickly. Okay, down comes Reyna. I give him a quick little Symbios. Symbio brother. He just got annihilated though, so... Run back down here. Might have to help Tyrion in a bit. Dragonite's really powerful early game, but he's really weak later game. That's probably the big thing about him. Uh, go with Pressurized Lance at the moment. Ouch, taking damage directly on Abatha. 
not too advised. Gets some more spike damage though, he gets kicked away again. That kick from the Dragonite is so strong. Okay, so he's been taken down. We're gonna lose a turret though anyway, which is a little bit annoying. An ally has been slain. We're gonna have to back up. Those toxic nests are pretty cool. Dragonite definitely does not scale, which is a little bit annoying. Abbott is also really slow. Um, I probably can't stop mid getting taken. If he just goes for this, he should be pretty fine. Like, getting a decent number of spikes down. That was a nice bit of play by Diablo there. Cool, good times. Choose a talent. Uh, Toxic next though, increase stab range. That's gonna be better. Really damage both. Probably gonna need to come and help mid. Uh, I'll just stay down here and just simply onto this. Get a bit more of this damage coming through. Uh, a range on his possess, I think there is, yeah, but I don't know it. Let me check quickly. Um, Okay, apparently no, there actually isn't. That's fairly cool. I think it's global, so I can just stay wherever I want. And I don't need to help up there. I might give a bit of help to you. About to get killed by two people if he's not careful. Keep more damage coming through. Okay, 30 seconds until Dragonite tries to back up. Still need to wait patiently at the moment. Uther needs to be way more careful. He's doing a good job at the moment though. You can attack a target while cloaked as well. Go for it Uther, go for it. Go for it baby. Back out now, back out. Don't go, don't go, don't go. It's so dangerous. Okay, so he's good. Should be able to take that. Acceptable. Which we could type. Uh, my Locust should still be spawning mid, which is important. Uh, I'm gonna come and help Uther again. He seems to be like pretty pro with things. An ally has been slain. They're pushing through nicely at the moment. Definitely get more damage down here. Cool, so he fought that off quite nicely. I'm gonna need some help mid though, pretty soon. Do another wave of that off and then I'll just quickly cancel it. Um. Choose a talent. Okay, ultimate evolution. This is my ultimate. Uh when it eventually shows. An enemy Keep the damage coming through. Okay, so Ultimate Evolution. Abadith creates a copy of a target ally hero and takes control of it. The evolution attributes are based on Abadith's current level and talent. So I can just make an exact copy of something, which is actually fairly huge. An ally has been slain. Uther should... Tab Abadith should have gone for that. I'll keep on Tyrael for the moment because he's probably going to die if he's not careful. An extra nice little bit of shielding coming through. Needs to be careful with stitches, so. They're still pushing through mid. They just need to take mid if they can. Or oh, top, rather. Um, I'm still pushing through mid quite nicely. I keep the poke damage going, which is really nice. Abitha pretty much reached peak strength now. Or oh, he gets stronger still, but always good. We need to really not lose that turret. Well, when do they? Ah, oh, they must have been ready and waiting for that. That's really annoying. Um, okay, so I'll head up to the top. Do you up there quickly? Gonna go for an exact copy of Rainer quickly. Wait for it to come through. Now we got two Rainers, which obviously will help. I think I'll grab these Aspires. Still backing away. Uh, uh, getting caught pretty bad though. Go for a Hyperion quickly. Double Hyperion for the win. Back away. Grab a heal up from the well. Oh, 
always fairly good getting this down. I'm focusing on trying to get a few more kills than the Dragon Knight, or a few a bit more damage down to pick him off. Because at early levels he is really strong. Okay, so I got taken out there. It's a bit annoying. Um, Save Diablo, I'm quickly. Give me a bit more health. Locust can cleave attack, definitely want that. I want to get that lane pushing to the max. Quickly switch off. Uh, I'm going to deep tunnel down to bot. I can still Locust. I can still Symbiote after the top though, which is probably more important. Let's see what Booth He just needs to be a bit careful, otherwise he's going to die. Uh, I don't have a shield. Bit annoying. Uther, move, you're still alive! You have your spirit form for so long! An enemy has been slain. Keep spamming these abilities, one day it'll work. Wait for another symbiote. Ah, oh, Diablo's got caught. Stitch has just completely killed his teammate with that. Fortunately, Diablo is a little bit stuck, but with Symbiote, should be okay. That's where you the moment. Okay, so we're ahead in experience now, that's pretty good. We've also got nice control. I don't quite know why Reyna just like used his penetrating round. Keep that shield up. Should be able to get some more damage down on Stitches. Should be able to get the kill. Yes, nicely done. Activate the shrines. Take my power. An ally has been slain. Okay, we need to get these shrines up. We can't let them have another dragon knight, really. Avoid it. Come on, Tyrion. Ah, uh, it's done this weird bug thing that's really annoying. Yes. They do now have both shrines. Looks like top's being contested though. Nice little head coming through. I think it's some help deterioral now. And then I can still just wait around here. An enemy has been slain. We're each holding one shrine. Oh, Tyrio, don't die. Tyrio, baby, keep running. You'll be okay. Back on out. Okay, so he's gonna recall. Now, Tyrio has been saved. I like the way they actually thank specialists. That's always good. More damage still coming through, so we're pushing down a fourth pretty nicely. We've got a small experience lead. Uh, shielded target to move fast, that's gonna be quite good. Um, I am now gonna need a few more of these. I don't know why I keep moving, I really don't need to. Grab on Abitha quickly. Uh, Tyrion with Tiro that life saving maneuver. Tiro doesn't go now, it's gonna be really frustrating. It looks like he is. Keep this damage going through. I need to be ready to come and help. The enemy has yeah. destroyed the Oh, I can't quite get the shield off in time. I pressed the wrong button. I was targeting something still, and I don't really know why. Uh, I can deep tunnel now up to here really damn quick, which would be really helpful. Especially if we're about to take that bottom shrine. Oh crap, I'm getting killed. That's why you don't do that. That was a bad move.
Uh, you don't... You don't possess the shrine if you control it. Basically, if you hold both of these shrines, you can possess the Dragon Knight in the middle. They need to try and take top. That'd be really important. Top's losing pretty bad throughout. Towers have ammo as well, which is worth noting. Something different from a lot of other movers. They have a limited number of shots. No, 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 don't go for it, Tyrael. Tyrael, you won't survive. Oh, that's nice of the kick, though. The flame The enemy has destroyed a fort. He's trying to get this damage too on the Dragon Knight. I'm gonna go for the double Rain Orb, which is always super good. I have to wait 10 seconds after taking control. Looks like Dragon Knight doesn't really know where he's going in the moment. Just a bit of danger top, but that should allow us to push through here pretty nice. Gonna go for the Rainer off the Siege up. Gonna have to keep backing away. Okay, go on, Gaz, let's go. That's nice. Meriden can just keep taking damage from me. It's fine. So much easier to play. But... Uh, two is gonna take some damage. Try and keep him alive as long as I can. Should have to finish off these kills now. Definitely gonna be able to finish off. Chase him, chase him, chase him! Chase him! Nice work. Brandon, Meriden as well can go down. Kill him, so a good amount of chief from that. Confirmed. We should take this mercenary cast. Adding down some more like of these Noxus mines. I don't know how many I can have on the map. They only last for 90 seconds, but the cooldown's less than that, so I think I can put more down if I so wish. I'm just trying to stay within experience range at the moment. The important thing with Abitha is just trying to maintain awareness of where you are. Drop another one of those down. Tear with some more help down here. Yeah, his pings are really good. Or whoever was pinging there, to let me know. It's really fun. Okay, Diablo's on his way up. Choose a talent. Keep going. I must be free. Broskis, you can do it. You can do it, Broskis. Yeah, they're not gonna do it. Uh, activate teleportation, no point. Uh, lower cooldown, increase uh, duration. <laughs> gonna go get Pyrrhus some help here. Ah, oh, they got the Dragon Eye again, that's so irritating, but I think we can kill like 3 quarters of them, which we're good. That was nice to do a spike there, 250 damage is nothing to be proud of. Ah, I'm getting absolutely owned here. I need to be more careful with my positioning. A uh, talent is basically what a... It's a, how you level up, you get different talents which buff you in different ways. It's instead of an item system. So there's no gold or anything, you just... Upgrade talents, they come up down in the bottom left here. 
There was about a 20 second delay by the way on stream because of Twitch. Dragonite's still in position though, he's a little bit annoying. My death timer seems to be taking forever. We haven't got one Dragonite yet which is a bit annoying but we're still slightly up on experience or at least level. But I think they've got way more forward down. Dragonite's been taken out though. Stitches is dead. Diablo is going to get taken down though, he's a bit too bold there. An enemy has been slain. An ally has been slain. An ally hey Dov, yeah, been I am actually better today. Thank you very much. Uh, gonna give... Should definitely be able to get the kill on him again. Nice times. I'm out of range at the moment. Um, okay, I can only teleport somewhere I've got vision, which is a bit annoying. Range, there is a talent that can give it a global range. But if you look at the minimap, that's its range on the Noxus Mines. Should be relatively safe here at the moment. Looks like Guth is getting ready to take one. A bit more damage to do that. We need to do secure up merc mercenary camps as often as possible, really. The enemy has destroyed if we get this four done, it'll be good. He's got no um, cook, so he got that done. Okay, so I'm in a really dangerous spot there, unfortunately. I'm gonna try and keep this more pushed if I can. Or at least keep it pushing nice. Will help a lot. Uh, I don't want to be moving forward. Abathur is going to have to back out. So I'm just backing away to safety. Uh, probably going to sit up. Uh, yeah, I'm not really sure. Here's actually quite a nice spot for me at the moment. Need to keep an eye on the shrines when they come up. Going to give Boothra a bit of extra help. Uh, the range of the Noxus Mines. Yeah, there is a range on it. So we should now get top. Shrine control, which is important. Um, we can also try and drop down a couple more mines about, which is important. Don't back out, Rainer! Oh, why did I symbiote Rainer, who has no idea what he's doing? Our ally requires help. Yes. Um, maybe come and retake this shrine top. It depends if anyone's up here. I don't know where they are. But if they're not, I can grab it quickly and then we'll actually hold both. If I can get this up, this would be huge. Just gonna deep channel the hell away. An ally has been slain. Keep the damage going, Reyna. Okay, run away now, Reyna. Broski, run away. Run away, Broski. Has been slain. Nope. He didn't feel like running. Yes. Okay, the enemy's got the Dragon Knight again. The next Dragon Knight's probably going to be pointless for us to get. I shall turn you to cinder. Um, probably our best bet is to try and get up someone nice and strong. Um, unfortunately, you got two dead, so I'm gonna just have to go with Diablo. I don't know what Diablo's gonna do. Okay, slow charge. Uh, I can knock him away, which is quite useful. Got to send out flames and a weird throw behind. Got lightning breath as well. That's seems fairly strong. Try and keep this damage going, Rimmel. Stab him down behind me. Try and keep this damage going. If I can keep it up, it'll be nice. Cool, that's another one taken down. 
Always good times. We can actually get a nice counter push going on. I can only really push at the moment because um, I'm going to run out of my evolution time. Ultimate evolution. <laughs> Is going to time out, but that's fine. Let me try and get a few more Noxious Mines down, except a bit out of range. So. An enemy has been slain. Acceptable. Tunneling up there. Um, looks like we're doing okay in every lane, so I'm just going to come up here for the experience farm. Should capture this mercenary. Give me a good few toxic, toxic mines, or toxic nests rather, coming through. I'm still very vulnerable with where I am at the moment. That's my Must biggest concern. Uh, the next Dragon Knight is going to be really bad to take. Just because he doesn't scale with the level, it'll actually be weaker than if we just didn't take it. Curious this enemy must be punished. Uh, gonna get some help down here. Hopefully I'm safe. Uh, I am going to look to back out again as well. Keep a few more of these Noxus. A toxic next coming through. Uh, maybe I should get a bit more help here. That Diablo ult so awesome that lightning breath. An ally has been slain. Cool. An enemy uh, we can get trines seen. now. I don't know if Locust does actually absorb experience. That's a An good ally question. Has been slain. <laughs> Fort destroyed. It's worthwhile me coming to get this as opposed to anyone else. Because I'm pretty useless in a team fight. So cool. Got the Dragon Knight now. So I've got Flame Breath towards an area. Savage Charge, short delay. Charge knocking back after dealing tons of damage. And I can leave it. Rubble Maker is my trait. Can we have to go through this pretty quick? This is a really nice push. We've got three of them dead as well, so we can maybe actually win with this push now. Should just try and push to as hard as we can. If we get the forts down here. Destroyed. Also very nicely done here. Yeah. So a rubble maker does. Oh, I explode upon death. Always nice. So we got down to four. I don't think we can actually win this fight though. There's only two there. We do have a nice little bit here, pushing through. How am I related to Blizzard? Um, I'm a caster for their World Championship Series for StarCraft 2. I do WCS EU Challenger. That's why I've got an invite to the Alpha. Oh, Tiro's gonna die. My in-game is a little loud. Okay, I'll just manually turn this down then. Um, quickly, I'll put it down to about... 75%. Hopefully that's a bit better. Let me know how that is. Tio is gonna die. He's doing his up. Oh, that was nearly some ninja moves. He needs to get back in range though because he explodes with his pa with his combat tray. Still waiting to see what he's gonna be able to do. Um, Keep destroyed. I wanna get up here. Um, just to drop a couple of mines up. Or nests, should I call them? Oh, you got to take that instantly. It's a nice detonation still coming through. Can you feel my wrath returning? An enemy Can has been slain. Okay, I think I'm gonna get killed by someone. Okay, shrines are about to come up again. <laughs> About 10 seconds, so I should be able to secure them pretty quickly. But I might die, it depends who other people are. 
it's just really risky here at the moment. An enemy has been slain. Okay, I can give the others a help. Quickly come back out. In here, it's going to be able to take the shrine up. I've got my toxic traps in position as well. Uh, yeah, if it resets your mic volume on setup, go into options, go into sounds. Actually, no, it might not be. Um, where have they put it here? Uh, blah, blah, blah. No, actually, it looks like there isn't. It's because it's built on the StarCraft 2 engine, and there is somewhere where there's voice chat, but it looks like they haven't implemented this, so it's a hidden feature, and you have to do something to voice chat to stop it changing your mic volume. A little bit of Uther on Uther action. Our Uther will win though because he's got the aid of an Abathur. An enemy has been slain. Cool. We can now definitely push through to the win. Um, I'm gonna head up to here. We should now win. Both teams are maxed out, level 25. An ally has been slain. Keep destroyed. Uh, gonna boot him the hell out of there. Oh, nice hook on me there. Just finish. I'm so dead. I don't want any people just to focus on their palace and we win and we win! Yes! Nice work team! You have been slain. That was good. Victory.